Introducing first, in the corner to my right, a company to ringside. Hey, Swampy, go get me a beer, baby. Accompanied to ringside by his personal server, Swamp Monster. He hails from wherever. His weight doesn't matter. Freshly squeezed Orange Cassidy. His opponent in the corner to my left, wrestling out of Maxwell Street. His opponent right behind me. Now to my left, from Maxwell Street, Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 238 pounds, Colt Boom Boom Cabana! Feast Championship Wrestling action here on Main Street in East Greenwich, Rhode Island. I am Paul Crockett, joined by the inimitable Joey Ryan. And Joey, what a matchup we have here to start things off. It's, uh, I mean, when you look back at the history of Feast Championship Wrestling, match number one is always going to be Orange Cassidy versus Cole Cabana, which is a star-studded match to say the least. Star-studded catches catch can here on Main Street, as evidenced there by this unbelievable display by Colt Cabana. This man knows how to work. Orange Cassidy's already lost his sunglasses, but oh, hasn't lost no. the match, kicked out on two. Well, he did tell his personal server, Swamp Monster, to find him a drink. So we're gonna see if that comes into play here. Well, Swamp Monster has returned. Uh, and I, surprisingly not dying of heat stroke right now. Yes, I'm, I'm shocked too, but he does in fact have his drink. The question is, as always here at Feast Championship Wrestling, how is the drink gonna come into play? Um, you know, or, you know, Orange Cassidy doesn't always seem like he has a game plan. He just kind of goes and does it. So I don't know if there's any thought process into this, but maybe there is. Maybe he studied Colt Cabana and, uh, and knows that he can use the beer to his advantage in this match. Well, he's holding on to the beer expertly, which you can always say about him, whether he's in the ring or at the bar, the man knows how to have a good time. And look at that, very impressive, reverses and has the beer held on. I don't know how much force he has behind his headlock, but he's got it nonetheless. Oh, don't want to spill that because there is going to be more action later on. We can have beer on the mat. And he's up and he's over and he holds on to the beer. So impressive. Drop. Not one drop spilled yet. Not one drop. Colt with the up and over and the leapfrog didn't quite. Didn't really connect, no. And now here goes Orange and he's under. What athleticism. He's a trained athlete, if that's for sure. And you say he doesn't have a strategy going in. I would say this is mind games at its best. I mean, so far so good, right? He's not he's not losing this match currently. No, if if I if anything, I, he's winning now. He's got Caban on his back. If I have a scorecard, it's definitely 10-8 Orange Cassidy right now. Cover, no. Only a one count, I'm surprised. Oh! Excellent job by referee Bryce Remsburg. You do not steal another man's beer. Respect the authority. Absolutely. Colt off the ropes, and again, and again, and up and over, sunset flip. Orange Cassidy holding on. And he's over. Oh, and now Bryce Remsburg. Shouldn't you practice what you preach? You just stole the man's beer. He's also not counting the three count that Colt Cabana currently won the match with. Enough with the beer. And Colt Cabana taking the beer away and saying enough. And now we have a beer holder. I didn't know that. Orange Cassidy's mind game's coming into play here. He is inside Colt's head. Now he's got a boot in his face. Big boot. He's going high rent district. What an arm drag, and he holds on to the beer. Unbelievable. 
and what a chant from this crowd here. Family show, I thought, but I guess not. Family show, I'm here. Oh, good point. When's the last time you saw an athletic display like this? Um, I mean, this is this here is new bounds. It's unprecedented. And now he said he's going around the world, going to the top. A little old school here with a beer. I never saw The Undertaker do this, although he probably wanted to. Takes a sip. He could definitely uh, pass a police uh, line test right now. Yeah, he's definitely uh, walk and turn too. Oh! Knife edge chop on Cabana. Taking a drink. Cover. Got a two count. No. Orange Cat, did. I don't think he put uh, any suntan lotion on. He's looking a little burnt. Yeah. He looks like he might be a little sensitive to the sun. Yeah, so one shot from Cole Cabana could really put him down. Here we go. Revving that engine as only Orange Cassidy can. What do you do as a competitor when you see a juggernaut like this coming at you? Uh, well, you throw forearm in his face. Oh, and like there's that chop I was talking about. He must be on Dream Street. Oh. Oh, spill the drop. He still has that beer. He's holding on, and now Colt looking to take him down. Missed. Oh, got him with a chop of his own. Oh, look at this furious combination from Orange Cassidy. Spinning back fist. What a combo. One more time. One more time. One more time. Ducks the clothesline. Oh. Super kick takes Cabana down. And now he's going up top. 630. What? Did he, did he just call for a 630? I think he did. Okay. 630 from the top rope. Oh, from the top. Okay. Here we go. He's up. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, the beer is right in front of me. Roll up. Cole Cabana got him. Major party foul from Colt Cabana. These kids are trying to retrieve this beer. I think we should not let them, maybe. What an opener. Party foul. No beer for you. Let's boo beer. And then because we get a spot on the card, people will wrestle. Get it on. 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 Get it